Okay, so I lied. I said I was done, right? But then I remembered that I deleted the previous video I had about my second big job because I wasn't really talking about my second big job. I was talking about caring for your TWA, and that should be in a separate video. So I initially went natural my sophomore year of college. That was back in, ooh, that was a while ago. Y'all don't ask me how old I am. I'm not talking about it. Just mind your business. But anyway, um, so I've been natural for five and a half years now. Um, I transitioned that particular time. I transitioned for maybe a year, um, and then I cut my relaxer off. So going in the first time I went natural, my hair was probably maybe maybe that long starting out. So I had a good amount of hair. Uh, last year, I have been natural for years, and I get bored, so I do different things with my hair. It might be braids, wigs, weaves, whatever, but I'll do different things. And I'm trying to give the wigs a break because... I don't, I don't know if I mentioned it. I think I took that video off. My hair, I'm in a lot of plays, too. I do a lot of plays at my school. So I wear the wigs the weeks prior to the play just to avoid having to do my hair and then smash it down with the wig in the first place. But it's broken my hair off all around the edges and in the back. So I'm going to, next year I'm not going to wear any weaves or wigs or anything. And I'll document that. But anyway, back to my going natural, well, back to my second big job. Um, I got bored. It was around the time of my birthday. My birthday is December 15th. Um, that was before my birthday when I got the initial haircut. My, I got the initial haircut in like October. So October I was like, I'm bored. I woke up one day and I was like, I want to have short hair. I've never had, I had never, up to that point, I had never had really short natural hair. I started off with some hair. So I was like, I'm just going to see what it's like to have a shortcut. And it be, and I have a relaxer, because usually when you get a shortcut, they go, oh, you're going to need to relax it to have the shortcut. So I was like, no, I'm not going to do all that. I just woke up and was like, I want a haircut. I printed off a picture of Eva Pigford, went to the hair salon, cut my hair. Shaved the sides off, and I had, it was longer in the top, and it was like tapered. And then I had like this little, it was, it was like a, mo a modified mohawk. It was, it was cool, though. I looked cute. I was real cute. And I thought I was fancy. But the shortcut was more maintenance than I had bargained for. Getting that, you know, keeping this clean on the side and the back clean, and making sure this didn't get too long in the top, that was too much work. I said, you know what, in January, I'm going to cut this part off. So I let the sides grow a little bit. They weren't even an inch long. I let them grow out a little. January of this year, shave it all off. I just shaved the middle off and made it all even with the sides that were already shaved, shaven. Um, and I, I felt great. It was wonderful. I really enjoyed my time of having that really, really short hair. It was so low maintenance and I felt like it looked good on me. Um, it is now November the 21st and my hair, I clipped my ends yesterday. My hair is this long now in the front. Goes to my lip. Can you see that? Goes to my lip. And in the back, my hair goes to my collarbone so I think in less than a year my hair has grown quite a bit um, and I just big chopped not because it was severely damaged or anything my hair was almost armpit length when I cut it off so I had a good amount of hair um, but I just I got bored and I wanted to do something different and I really enjoy the process of growing my hair back out I like the different stages I like this weird in between middle stage where my hair is not long and it's not really, really short anymore I like the really really short stage I like the stage when it's getting longer I can do more with it I like that I enjoy growing my hair back out because I enjoy the process and learning because my hair texture is slightly different this time it's more dry it it shrinks more and the curl pattern is more of a zigzag now than it was before it was more like a little spiral but I, I enjoy it and um I think this time around I'm taking much better care of my hair than I was before. Before when I was natural, I didn't really start taking good care of my hair. And I told y'all I had been natural for five and a half years. I didn't really start taking good care of my hair maybe for, until the last two years of my natural hair, natural hair process, whatever you want to call it. Um, I, I always had some type of catastrophe 
color damage, heat damage, um, wasn't clipping my ends, and I would have to cut two and three inches off my hair at a time, like, for the first three years I was natural. And then I decided to really take care of my hair, and then it's when it flourished and grew, but then I got bored, and I was like, I want a haircut. So this time around, knowing what I know now, having the knowledge that I know, I know that my hair will be much healthier, and I can grow it with, and maintain the length that I'm gaining when I'm growing it out. So that's it. That's why I did it. And that's what happened. And I'm done. So I lied before and I said I was done. Because clearly I have on the same clothes. So you know I made this video on the same day as the other one. <laughs> it's not a secret. But I'm finished. So enjoy your day. For this time. Bye.